The Tulsa Glass Blowing School is a nonprofit organization, uh, basically where anybody off the street can come and learn how to blow glass. Uh, our main programming is directed at uh, educating young people and helping people that may not have art programs or may not be able to afford access to certain art programs to be able to let them come experience glass and even teach them extendedly um, how to blow glass and, and, and even do glass in other art forms. Good glass art or the best glass art, it's, it's really subjective to the viewer. Um, you know, you can, you can technically, as a glass artist, you can pick apart everything. You can say, oh, I think this was made well or I think this was made not well or, or, or something like that. But it, it, as a matter of art, it's so subjective because you don't necessarily have to have the best technique or have the, or you can have the best technique and still not pull off the idea. It just each viewer is going to bring their own experience to the work. My creative persona, I like to just push that every time. And as long as I can do that and people enjoy looking at it and people enjoy buying it, then, then I feel it's successful. And that may or may not be how other people perceive successful art, but that's how I perceive it. And, you know, if, if, if I can make a living making what I love to make and people love buying it and people love looking at it, then I think it's a success. Uh, Some Like It Hot is our annual event. We, uh, we do it every about the beginning of every summer. This year it's on June 13th. Um, we're going to have it at the Mayo. Um, it's, it's a silent auction feeding into a live auction, cocktail party with a dinner. Um, it's, it's basically our biggest fundraiser of the year. Us doing that event and raising that money, it helps us to scholarship some kids for six, eight, ten week programs so that they can actually consider themselves competent glass blowers by the time they're finished. So we're, we've really gotten all of our relationships out there and gotten people to, to really start helping us to help the community because you know, that's, that's what we're here for. Um, my, my job is to make work, but our facility is to educate.